Yeah, we left Shells on Tuesday, went down, trained with Atlone on the Wednesday and then got announced obviously an hour before the game and then from that it's went into what's happened. No, I got told on Wednesday that would be starting and then he just pulled me before the game saying go out and enjoy yourself, it's a cup game, we're not expected to win so just went out and played free. To be honest, when, when the game was going on I just wanted to get the hat-trick so when they scored that goal and the rest of it, just the last kick I was going mad because I was thinking oh, I'm not going to get the hat-trick on my debut and then obviously that happened but we didn't think it was going to blow up as much as this. I knew it was a good goal and a special time but I didn't think it was going to go this crazy around the world. Yeah, I just said to the ref how long's left and he said this is actually the last kick and then one of the boys killers said to me, ping it up to me. I said no, I'm going to have to shoot. So as the ball was rolling back to me, I was watching the keeper and I seen him step up and I just thought I'm going to have to go for it and luckily it came off. I didn't even really have like, I wasn't 100% on what to do, I was waiting to see what the keeper done. And obviously I seen him stepping out to anticipate the long ball and I said, I'm going to have to go for it now and lucky enough we caught a sweet. Have to try and pump this ball forward and try and get something. So, we're just yeah. going to run forward. McCauley tries to hit one from long range. Oh, what a goal! Yeah. Claude McCauley! What a goal! Yeah. This is what just unbelievable! Claude McCauley! Take it, bro! What a goal! I, mean, I can't even remember seeing the ball go in. We can just remember everyone shouting and then the celebrations and then obviously I was concentrating on the penalties then and I can't really remember the 10 minutes after the goal went in. My phones blew up from it. I didn't expect it to go this mad but all the views and all the pages putting up on Instagram and Twitter it's been crazy. The League of Ireland is not a, a world known league and to see it blow up and especially for a small club like Atlone to be getting all the publicity it's, it's good for the country and the club. 100% I don't think the league gets appreciated for what it is, there's a lot of good players, obviously you've seen last year Jack Bourne and then the type of Will Patchen and all playing the league for Dundalk, there's some very good players in the league. Since I've came home I've not got the chances that I would have liked up in playing out of position and I felt like going to that alone, Adrian Carby said that you give me the chance to play my position and I just want to go out and show what I can do once I play as a striker. I don't think I'll ever score and like it again.